Hi, my name is Shiloh Brown. I'm 18 and I run my own do rag business called Silky Babies. So I cater to the needs of Afro-Caribbean hair, of course. I sell do rags, bonnets, ski masks for the people that like to wear ballets. I sell matching sets. So if you've got a friend or even for couples, I sell satin head scarves. So if you want to tie up your hair, uh, for my Muslim women, of course. I cater to all needs pretty much, so wh whoever wants it, they can have it. To start my own business, the person who inspired me was my oldest sister. She gave me the idea that if I really wanted to make money and not be tied to commitments or have someone managing me or bossing me around, I had to start my own. So she gave me the idea of choosing something that I love, something that I have knowledge on and something that I know could sell well and my choice was do-rags because that used to be my main accessory the one thing that i loved most in the world and if anyone bought me a do-rag as a gift it was the one thing i cherished the most my plans for my business is expand uh by selling more things to cater to more people's needs not just to the black community but to everyone i'd also in the future i'd hope to maybe even open a shop somewhere somewhere nice somewhere somewhere where i'd have lots of customers somewhere it would be known and could blow up that's what i'd like if if you want to start a business make sure you've got all the necessary knowledge on the products the audience and the platform that you're going to be selling on that's my advice before i started my business the one thing that i should have known was that there are a lot of dry seasons where you get zero customers, no one inquiring about your business, people forgetting it exists. And the only way to avoid that is by constantly reposting, sharing your business, letting everyone know, tell them to give it to their friends and their friends and their friends and their aunties, uncles, uh, their pets, their cats, their fish, everyone. Everyone needs to know about the business. If you keep it to yourself, how, how are you gonna sell? How's anyone going to find out about something that you're not sharing? Make sure you promote your, your business to the max and always keep a positive outlook. There's going to be dry seasons, but eventually, if you keep trying your best and do what you're supposed to do, it will get better and you'll be, become rich eventually. <laughs>